Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Ashley Evans, and you're watching Black Onyx, bringing you face to face with some of the most talented asset managers. And today I'm joined by Mark Pertold from Umber Investments. Mark, thank you so much for joining us. Pleasure. Thanks for having me. To start off with, can you tell us about yourself, your firm, and your team? Sure. I'll briefly about myself, I grew up in South Africa, as you can probably tell from my Joburg accent. I uh, studied chartered accountancy at Fitz University. Did a little stint, stint abroad with KPMG, um, where I articled, and then got the travel bug and wanted to work abroad for a few years. So went to London without a job and landed up doing debits and credits for a big American bank called Goldman Sachs. And we were a financial analyst on the desk, building portfolios for clients, investing clients' money. That really took me then on a 10-year journey in that team where I spent, ended up being 12 years at Goldman Sachs, um, looking after ultra high net worth and family office clients, charities, foundations and the like building global portfolios for them using multi-asset allocation models and the like. And that was really the, the genesis and the background as to how I got into this industry. Having been an accountant, it's completely different, but it gave me very good grounding on lots of different things as pertains to investing, different asset classes, equities, bonds, hedge funds, private equity, the way in which you put those together, lots of derivatives. And we then decided with a colleague of mine, David, in about 2015, that a lot of the things that were happening in banking could be done better. And so it was actually at a, at a friend's party in 2014-2015 period, over a bottle of wine, just chatting about issues we felt we were seeing, from David more from an operational perspective and me from a client and investing perspective that we saw within banks and things could be done better. And also in this digital age of disruption with technology, a lot of banks and large firms had legacy systems. We felt we could deliver a solution to, to savers at a cheaper price and potentially better, but embracing some of the new technologies that had developed in terms of market structure. And that's, that really led us to using exclu exclusively ETFs in our investment process. In terms of the team, we're, we're actually quite a few South Africans. Um, five of us were born in South Africa, but we all live in London. And we're now seven full-time and we have a non-exec director as well. And we got together in, in, in different ways, but the initial two people were Dave Pearson and myself. We were at Fitz together, and he, he was doing an information systems background, so more tech-oriented, and I was doing the chartered accountancy route. And we came together, and we set up the firm, and then we started to hire people. And just through word of mouth and people we met through our networks, respectively, we ended up hiring a lot of South Africans initially. Subsequently, we now have a more international group of people in the team. But we're South Africans based in London, and we deal a lot with South African clients here through, by virtue of the fact that we're a South African team. So a little bit more about the team. We, we actually have uh, mostly financial services and, and, and banking backgrounds. But just to give you a bit of background, we've, we've got three chartered accountants in the firm. We've got two lawyers. We've got a mathematician and quant. Um, we've got an engineer. We've got an information system specialist. And we all hail from big firms across the world. I mean, brands like, and, and firms like Goldman Sachs, Barclays, EY, KPMG, RMB, Ethos Private Equity, Investec, Coots, et cetera. So we're a very experienced team in terms of our professional experience, but we've all come together in the small firm because we share a common vision about what we want to deliver to our customers. And that's a really a better value proposition. 